What is going on, guys? It is Tony from Lomo Paintball, and today we are talking about the Virtue Strapless Breakout Harness. And why? Because who's the best source for paintball? Well, that would clearly be LoneWolfPaintball.com, as everybody knows. So before I jump into a quick little discussion review on this Virtue Pod Pack, head on over to PBSwagBag.com, use our code LWP10 at checkout to save 10% off your first monthly subscription. Or don't and pay full price. Oh, true. All right, so... Getting a lot of different pod packs in the warehouse, in the pro shop, all that good stuff. We've come across the Virtue Breakout harness. I know it's been out for a minute, um, but we're going to talk a little bit about it. And in the next video, do a comparison with a little something else. So Virtue Breakout, uh, the one on the table is a four plus seven, holds four main pods, any pod from a 135 count to 165, which I currently have in here. And then you've got seven extra loops. You've got two, you've got three, four, five, and another two is seven. So it holds four main and then seven others. So 11 total. So this pod pack can definitely hold a lot um, before we go into the next. These are 80 bucks. So very, very good pod pack. A lot of players seem to like it for 80 bucks. I mean, that's pretty standard and a lot, some pod packs are a lot more than that. So I do like it. All right, Mark, we're going to get into some of the features. So like I said, currently I have the 165 pods in there right now. We'll pull one of these bad boys out. The thing about this, it is, according to Virtue, it is one of the best packs on the market for strapless unload and reload. You can obviously get it pulled out and you can put it back in so you're not leaving your pods out there on the field with ease. And we'll find that out towards the end of the video. See if I can't do it with it behind my back, pull one out and get it back in there without losing it. Um, so let's crack this bad boy open. First off, we do have a four-way lockdown system. If you don't know what that means, you've got one, you got two, you got three, and then you've got four. Ooh, Mark, you like that, Mark? That is fancy. Breakout. So you know what pad, pod pack you're wearing. So yeah, the four definitely is going to help with stability. When you actually wrap that thing around your waist, you're going one, two, and then tighten it down three and four so it's not jumping up and moving around on you. Next, we're going to talk about the inside of this bad boy. First, you're going to see that Royal Comfort um, padding in here. It's literally like a nice little squishy pillow. Provides great uh, comfort and support for your back. Obviously, if you're wearing this thing all day long, you're going to want something that is very soft and squishy, very comfortable, because you're probably going to be wearing this with a lot of weight with the paint inside the pod. So I do, I do like that. Second off, talking about the inside of this pod pack. There are no internal adjustments like some of the other pod packs on the market where they have like... Um, different straps for the size pods you're putting in here. So I do like that, that you don't have to make any adjustments in through here with any Velcros or straps. It fits the 135s up to the 165 pods. And you'll see with pretty much, pretty good ease, these are the bigger pods, I mean, in and out. So you can literally, I mean, there's no, it doesn't take too much tension, but you can also tell these things aren't gonna fall out. That is due to extra support from these elastic straps up top. We were talking about this before the video started. This is a really good idea up here. Obviously your main compartment, it holds a pod nice and snug, but this elastic up here is just extra support. So hopefully down the road, when your pack starts to get old, these will help uh, keep the pods in there longer. As we all know, a pod pack's not gonna last you forever. You're putting it through the, the sweat, the mud, the dirt, and getting shot up with paint. Eventually you're gonna have to replace it, but I like that they added this little extra support there. Mark, is there anything else on this pod pack? Obviously, completely strapless. We are not dealing with that. We've got the nice um, logos on there, so everyone gets a little chance to see what you're rocking out there on the field. One of my favorite things, like I said, is this nice Royal Comfort, um, I'm gonna call it the pillow in the back, definitely keeping your back nice and comfortable back there. Uh, two questions. Go ahead. The first question is, do the large pods that you have there fit in the secondary pod straps? That's a good question. Let's find out. Obviously, this one's brand new, so we will uh, we'll go a further loop. And uh, yeah, I'm sure they will. I mean, obviously, with it being brand new, yeah, but it's definitely going to fit on the outside. You know, I'm going to see if you can't get two of the bigger pods next to each other. We'll see. We shall find out. That'd be a lot of paint. If you that is going to be a lot of paintballs. This one, I don't think you're going to be able to, to actually do it by yourself um, when it's on your back. But yes, they do. I mean, they will sit. They will sit side by side on there. So, yeah. And my only other question is, 
uh, how is the grip when you're putting the belt on? Like some of them have like a, a rubber to grab onto to pull it tight. So your fingers don't slip off. This the one belt. does have one on the on the last strap you're pulling over. It's going to be right here. It's got that nice rubber grip on there, so your hands aren't going to be slipping off on it. Awesome. Lastly, Mark, we're going to like I said at the end of this video, is going to put this bad boy on. Uh, reference waist wise, I'm about a 36, so we'll see what um, is this pod pack going to fit. Bigger guys, littler guys, definitely littler guys. I'm going to undo it. So we're going to throw this on. Very comfortable with that back, that back uh, pillow. So four-way lockdown, feeling good, I like it. And let's see if we can't actually get one of these pods back, back in there. He did it, guys, yeah. he really did it. Yeah, and then we got one more over here. Let's see if I can't left-handed. That's it, beautiful. Uh, Virtue said they did what they said it was gonna do. Something like that, yeah, you can easily unload and reload these so you're not leaving your expensive pods on the field. And Mark, as always, where do they find these bad boys? LoneWolfPaintball.com. Take it easy, guys.